Creator gave you a different set of eyes, the eyes of your mind. And over there, inside your own mind, you can grasp the complete picture from within. To understand it all outside, million years of learning will not bring you to all the answers to perceive and to digest and to understand all the knowledge. You can never in billion years understand the structure of one leaf, of one cell. Because godliness is being reflected into a one leaf, into one cell. You will never finish that journey because it's endless. But when you nullify yourself and attach and connect yourself to your inside, to your soul, you will understand it all at once. Suddenly all the picture will be perfectly clear to the eyes of your mind. But for that you need to look deep into the roots of your spirit. And the first step for that is to accept yourself. Is to stop hating and blaming yourself. It's to stop following those negative voices of the evil inclination that his only mission on earth is to break your self-esteem and to destroy your inner love to yourself and to make you blame yourself and hate yourself and criticize yourself and break yourself to pieces and slaughter yourself alive for things that never were depend on you. You're going to hate yourself for the color of your hair. Can there be something stupid than that? You're going to hate yourself for the shape of your face, for the shape of your eyes, for the color, for your accent, for your parents, for your friends, for your society, for your salary, for your house, for your neighborhood, for your knowledge, for things that are not in your reach. Things that you have not decided on. Things that you can never decide. On. What can you decide to want? Only the will is in our hands. Only the will is free and is in your hand to want. And when you find your will weak, you need to want to want. You need to increase your will and to convince yourself that it's the time to want more. And even in times of destruction, and even in times of pain, and even in the hardest hours that despair is surrounding you from 360 degrees, and you find yourself completely lost with no answer, and only questions you have, and only doubts, and only fears, and panic attacks, and, and anxieties all around you, darkness is surrounding you. In that moment, you need to dare to ignore your surroundings and to look deep into the root of your soul and there you will find Him. There you will find the answer. 